In this video, I will show you how to make a Fluffy Bird game. So, there will be pipes moving towards you. You have to dodge them. And whenever the bird drops down, it will, like, turn. And if you hit the pipes or the ground, you, you lose. Alright. I'll first delete the cat. Make a new sprite. I'll make bird. Fix it. All right, I'm done. I'll just rename it bird. Now, when we flat click, I want to set it like here. So, Y will be zero. It will all start in the middle. And 30. Yep, this is good. And pick a new variable gravity. Okay, so forever change gravity by negative one and then change y by, make sure it's y by, not x, because x is left and right and y is up and down by Change Y by gravity, so it's constantly falling, always gaining speed, but we have to always reset it every time we start. So there you go, that's good. Now we need to get the bird to fly. Okay, so when space press, get another one green flag click so you can choose any key you want to control with I'll choose space set gravity to 9 so that's working but we have a problem is that when we hold space it just like glides up but we won't constantly press space to fly. So to do that, wait until the space is not pressed. So that's working. So we can't hold space to fly. And we can add one more thing to make it cooler. So when, we, when the bird drops down, it will turn so grab a addition and multiplication put it like this oops sorry not like this 90 plus gravity times negative 2 and then get a point in direction put it in there this now that should work so whenever it drops down it would turn now we can remove the gravity variable so because we, we don't need it players won't need it <clears throat> you can go change the size to 80 tiny it's so good now we can get to pipes. Hmm. Okay, I'm done. Name this pipes. So, green flag click. We want it forever. Make. Make 
for you to clone yourself. When it starts as a clone, we, we want to set it end. So here. So at the end, it will always make a clone. And we always want to randomize its Y position, which is up and down. So we get operators, random, negative 75 to 75. fast get a delay create a delay two seconds yeah we always have to hide its main the main pipe so hide it start and show it when it creates the clone so now it's working Now we need to make the pipes move. So grab a repeat on tilt. Go to motions, move, negative five steps. So that's working. We have a problem is that when When the pipes reach the end, it just stays there, which we don't want. So we can fix that. Go to operators, grab bigger than. So if X position is so repeat until x position is bigger than negative 200 oops on sorry it's not a it's not a small it's not a bigger than it has to be smaller if x position is smaller than negative 200 negative 50 this is good so try that yep that's pretty good i think i'll add blue sky backdrop it will look better and we can add the ground so we make that okay I think this is good good enough green flag click That's good. I think I'll lower it. So this depends. It might not like the the numbers might not be the same. So I'll do five. Yep, this is good. We're still missing one more thing is the point system point okay so put pipes you want to change the point to one every time it reaches the end so that should work yep and we always want to set Points back to zero. Here, here. Because if we don't have that, it will just stay the same. And one more thing 
that when we touch the ground or the pipes, nothing really happens. We just go through it. So the way to fix that. If. If we touch. It's not and. Or. The pipes or oh, I forgot to rename this ground then stop all <clears throat> yep now it's working touch the pipes there you have it we're done you got your own Flappy Bird minigame. Thanks for watching.